Hey guys, how are you? Happy July 1st. So we have something really interesting today. Yeah, I've, uh, this just, this really came out of nowhere. And uh, you know, I gotta see it through because this box is kind of big. It's really interesting because it says lip gloss. Okay. Oh, oh my gosh. It says make lip gloss. <laughs> what the heck? Oh, interesting, because this isn't the one that I got. Piper Peach. Huh, let's see what's going on here. Whoa, oh my goodness. Do you see how large this is? She's so cute. She's really dark. She's, I think she's darker than Georgia, if I'm not mistaken. So she appears to be a combination of Sabrina and Georgia. It's so weird because I think she has like Georgia's dress, kind of, but she has Sabrina's jacket but she has georgia's hair but it's kind of like a mixture it's a mixture of both i think wow that's so fascinating she's definitely darker than them so wait this is really cool i feel like this is such a special moment because this could be like the next big thing they have a little bit of a, okay let's, let's get her out wow this is crazy okay i gotta post her on instagram let me do that really quickly Ooh. okay so here are the other characters but it's interesting because it seems like there's multiple iterations of them i don't know if these ones are the same size as this one i did see these ones on the website and there are versions of these with like actual hair as well so i don't know where this came from but they definitely look like rainbow high characters piper peach changing people's emotions when she blows a scented kiss so yeah i did notice that it says that i'm scented interesting okay let's see what she has in the box Okay, so we have some sprinkles in the box. And I don't know if it's placebo, but I feel like I already smell something. And it's like a very pleasant scent. Oh, I think it's placebo. She has a lot of hair. Um, I, I think that it's premium nylon. I don't know. I'm definitely going to do a heat test and everything. And this is flocked. So it's, you know, if you don't like that texture, then <laughs> you're kind of SOL. Yeah, I don't smell anything yet. I thought I was earlier, but wow, look how cute this is. Hold on. Oh. <laughs> Wait a minute, no, this might be my new obsession. If she's heavy, you guys know I love heavy dolls. I still don't smell anything. And I was hoping that I would get a whiff of like, I don't know, peaches when I opened her. Oh, so I gotta add, I gotta make her smell. I gotta add the scent. The bubble gum on the bubble princess doll is not removable. She has, oh, I gotta get her. I gotta get her. Apply lip balm. Oh, so you put the lipstick on? Is that what this little thing is for? Okay, this is so cool. Okay, let's try this. So she has a really cute little comb. Okay, and it's hollow. And she doesn't come with much, but I think that you mix these two together. Lip balm. Wait, what's happening here? <laughs> I like that. <laughs> it's so weird, the psychological effect that this has on me because I feel like I'm getting whiffs of the scent, but I know that I'm not. So it's like a, I don't even know what this is, um, but it's cute, right? And you open it up. What do I do with this? <gasps> so this is lip, <gasps> oh, it's actual lip balm, whoa. Oh my gosh, okay, let's look at the doll. Here she is, oh my gosh. Like I said, I really like the size of her. I like like big and like heavy dolls. I don't know, I'm just into that right now. And she has so much hair. Look how beautiful, it's super soft. It's just like rainbow high hair, so you can straighten it, you can curl it. Again, this is such an unexpected product that I'm I'm just, I needed something that was different and new. And I'm happy that they ship so fast too, because I think I wanna get more. <laughs> look at the edges. Okay, let's have a look at her face. So her face is super cutesy. I love the lips and the blush. Oh my gosh, it's too cute. I do have a little bit of a misprint here. And this is what it's supposed to look like. I don't mind too much. Um, the eyebrows are really like um, adult-like eyebrows, so that's interesting. I love the baby hairs. I'm happy that they included that. I think that that really elevates the doll personally. But look at this head crown. Like what? What is all of that for? That's amazing and it's so cute. I think I'm gonna keep this hairstyle or maybe, yeah, I think I like the hairstyle like this. It's so cute. I, I mean, I'm gonna wash the hair and everything obviously because there is a little bit of gel in it right here, but let's see how long it is in the back. Oh my gosh, so it goes past her feet. Her hair is super long. I just love it. It's super high quality, and it has that, that typical like rainbow high blend. Uh, it looks more pinkish in person, and it looks more orangey on camera from what I'm seeing. 
but there's some streaks of white here all throughout it's just so pretty like oh my gosh again like i mentioned earlier her coat <laughs> it's flocked and oh that's interesting it's not like a one piece situation it's like oh okay i guess whatever works so i i don't think you can take it off separately it's like all one piece it's weird hold on that's how they're attached <gasps> oh Oh, this is so cute this is like this is great for people who are fans of rainbow high but you know this is like the brats like the brats babies of rainbow high <gasps> look articulation it's so cute i love her little bikini oh can she sit down she can't really sit i mean that's so adorable wow i wonder if she can stand on her own um but look at her shoes little gold they're very simple oh I'm normally not a fan of like baby kind of dolls, but something about her just really does it for me. I don't know. Like I really want to see the other ones now. This is her whole outfit. <laughs> but so far I'm I'm loving her. I really do. I don't know how much they cost though. I forgot how much I paid. But so far I feel like she was worth it. Like I really do. It's so cute. I think kids will love it. I think adults will love her. Look, you can like swivel the head every which way. All right, so I've just taken the tags and everything out and this is her hair again she's super well rooted i mean let's have a look she has so much hair and the part line is stupendous so soft and beautiful look how pretty wow such an unexpected product i really was not expecting this or anything like it from rainbow high i don't know i feel like they're like testing the waters a little bit if you are a fan of rainbow high you're gonna love this doll for sure because rainbow high dolls already have those big heads and this just really elevates it and you just have so much hair like oh my gosh and it's gonna be so fun to style okay so this is just the color and then this one is the scent okay i got it so two to three drops let's do that <laughs> Yeah, you gotta be careful opening this up because it is really oily. I don't know how much of the color. So am I supposed to put it on my lips or the doll's lips? Ooh, like what? Look at this. I love the smell. It's not the best smell ever, but it's pretty pleasant. It's looking a little more lip glossy now. I just tried it on. It doesn't have a taste to it, but it's pretty nice. I mean, it's, it's a very generic type of lip gloss feeling, I mean. It's nothing special. It's definitely for kids. I wonder what the other ones smell like. Okay, yeah. So I'm so excited. I'm gonna wash her hair and everything. I'm definitely. I do. I want to buy another one and do like an ASMR video because I think it'll be really fun. But this hair is just so luscious and thick and full and heavy. I like how we're like the same skin color. So cool. So for reference, her head is. <laughs> it's like as big as the the big kylie doll um it's just like elongated you know it's it's more wide here she is next to rainbow high dolls she's a very large doll and by the way they can stand on their own how adorable you just have to like balance them out that's so cute i'm so obsessed with this so thankfully piper peach has the same typical rainbow high hair so i'm just following the same procedure that i normally like to take um it's really interesting though because it's seeing this hair type on such a massive scale it's a, a very stark difference between the regular sized rainbow high dolls and the kylie you know the big kylie doll has nylon from what i can understand however it's a different grade of it i believe so this one is going to give you that really satisfying like playtime. i don't know it's just really fun it's kind of a lot though and i was really worried about water getting inside of the head i haven't noticed any like water leakage since i've washed her hair but her neck hole is, is kind of big so i would be mindful of that but i don't think that i had any issues with it as i mentioned earlier she did have a little bit of gel in certain parts of her hair and you know obviously just like running it under warm water is gonna ratify that <laughs> that's typically how it is but you know i have to go the extra mile and i like to start from the end to the roots whenever i'm detangling and you know like i said she has so much hair so this definitely took a little while it took way longer than you know you would like to take detangling a doll's hair but it was totally worth it because it's super satisfying and i'm happy that they made her really thickly rooted I, I don't think that i was expecting that i thought they were going to kind of cop out but they, they they gave her a full head of hair so that's cool i'm really wanting to get the pink one I, who is who is that character emulating um i think it's is it stella i'm not really sure but she has a bubble gum in her mouth and i think that's super cool and i, I think it says it's not removable in the little 
profile so i'm really excited to see what she looks like in person as well and also to know what she smells like and everything since we are now in a new month that we're going to be seeing a lot more new dolls coming up and there are a few that i have my eyes on that i'm actually really excited for um, I saw some new Monster High dolls that I, I think I released. I, it was like a leaked Draculaura, and she's freaking gorgeous. I'm like, oh my gosh, I have to get my hands on her. But let me know if you have any like upcoming dolls or just like dolls in general that you're interested in purchasing right now. Enjoy this quick little slow-mo montage, and I'll be right back in a minute. So at first I was gonna let her air dry, but then I realized I could just blow dry her hair. I mean, I've owned the uh, blow dryer for a couple of years now, so I don't know why I never utilized it. But yeah, I blow dried her hair because I knew I wanted to straighten it after. So that way when I curl it, it could be like as silky and perfect as possible, even though the curls didn't end up being up to my standard but it's fine because the blow drying part was super satisfying and it looks it looks cool i think that the like the blowout look really suits her and i'm sure most people will just stop there but yeah you can also tell that her hair is kind of lopsided like you know the right side appears very much longer than the left side and so i did cut it off camera and i made sure that it's more leveled and there was actually a, a part in the process that like after i straightened it i was really hesitant to curl it like you'll see in a minute here but i was like should i keep it like this but i knew that i was doing a tiktok and i know that people would probably like to see it curled again so i don't know but i might go back and just like straighten it the way that i had it um in a minute but like i said earlier i'm just going to be giving her her original style back you know I, I didn't have any interest on restyling or giving her any extravagant hairstyles because i mean it looks like a little like child <laughs> so i think it would be kind of weird to give her like a drag queen hairstyle when she looks so cutesy and you know so that little headband that she comes with it's like, it's like human sized so you can like wear it on your head or you can put it on a child's head but you kind of can't at the same time because it's it's kind of hurt like it, it hurts a little bit and those spikes are a little sharp that holds it in place so i'm just going to be putting the crown back on the doll i put it on my niece she was like owie <laughs> Oh, uh, speaking of, this is a really cute part. Um, I gave her to my niece, and here's her reaction. Hi. <laughs> Hi, baby. Oh, give her a kiss. Give her a hug. Oh. Uh. <laughs> yes, as suspected, my niece absolutely loves this doll. Um, can you blame her? <laughs> but yeah, so here, you know, I just flashed when her hair was like straight, but now we're moving on to the curling process. And again, um, the hair is a little heavy, so it kind of elongates and stretches downward the longer, you know, so you really have to hold everything in place. And it was just like a lot, but I, I, I learned from this and you can see here, like the curls, they're, they're not really as ringletty as I would have liked, but it's fine. I really don't care. In the end she still turned out cute and getting her jacket piece on was a little bit of a struggle i'm not gonna lie however i still really do love the doll and i think that a lot of you guys will love her as well i'm definitely gonna get the other one the pink one and i'm super excited about that i'm gonna do an asmr video and we'll see how that turns out but for now i guess that's it guys thank you so much for stopping by and i wish you the best of luck this month of july <laughs> and um yeah actually happy fourth of july that's coming up really soon um, but for now, I'm gonna be going, but I love you guys, and I will see you in the next video. Hopefully, it comes a lot sooner than this one came, but yes, thank you so much. I love you, and I will see you next time. Bye-bye.